every last one. About time someone wiped those bastards out. Yeah, if someone's wiping out gangs, they can stay sharp. of a setup just to get people sauced. Thank you. I didn't know if anyone would come. I thought perhaps this is the end. Uh, thank you, thank you. You are true friend. Are there more of them? Are they gonna come after you again? No, no. This was best they could do. You got them. <laughs> <laughs> These idiots had caps and cams just lying around. <laughs> they, they did not notice when I filled my pockets. You deserve what I took. Ah, and Travis, I am surprised to see you here. <laughs> hey, Vadim. I'm glad you're safe. How did you get roped into this? I, I wasn't forced or anything. I wanted to help. You are full of surprises, my friend. Perfect.
I'm through. Made quick work of that. Going up. What you got for me? Piper, 
You know, you look like you could really use this. These things have literally saved my life. Your thoughts? Well, at least the price of drinks is right. Your thoughts? Anything I can do? You just say the word. Is everything okay between us? Well, things aren't bad. <laughs> because believe me, you'd know if they were. But I suppose we could be doing better. That's all for now. All right. Well, if anyone could figure out a good use for it...
sweet. Manage to find your fair share of trouble, don't you? Ugh. Oh, I hope this stuff is dust. Hey. Hmm? Hey, Piper. You really do have a talent for finding trouble, don't you? It usually finds me. Hey, I'm not one to judge. Honestly, it's just nice to not be doing it alone for a change. <laughs> In my line of work, things tend to get pretty hairy. I've been shot at, poisoned, nearly executed. <laughs> Heck, until recently, they called the lockup in Diamond City the Piper Suite. Anything for a story, I suppose. Seems that execution didn't quite take, huh? <sighs> Thank God. I'd been working on this story about irradiated drinking water in Bunker Hill. I traced the water back to its source through these old sewer tunnels, and what do I find? The children of Adam, setting up like they own the place. Unfortunately, they found me just as quick. Turns out they were not fond of reporters. So, to atone for my trespassing, they decided to make a sacrifice to Adam. Me. <laughs> I'm kneeling there, about to get the boot into this huge sewer pipe, when suddenly I blurt out, Adam, he reveals himself. And they buy it. They pull me back from the ledge and then gave me their induction ceremony. You are looking at an official acolyte of Adam. Took me a couple more days before I managed to sneak away, get Bunker Hill security to finally clean the place up. Someone poisoned you? Pfft, you kidding me? I barely had the paper going before I got poisoned. First time, I just published an article about this cartel of caravans that had been driving up food prices in the city. Article went over well, even got a boycott of their goods started in town, so I figured I'd pop over to the dugout inn for a victory drink. I'd already taken a swig by the time I realized something was wrong. The Dean, he wasn't at the bar. The beer tasted off, even more so than usual. And I started feeling real woozy. I don't know what he slipped me, but I knew I had to get it out. I'm looking around for something, and there it is, the still, and I just start chugging moonshine. Honestly, I'm still not totally convinced it was better than just dying from the poison, but it worked. Blech. And while I was passed out on the floor, security managed to grab the bartender. He eventually ratted out his bosses, and they all got to share some time in the pen. You've led an exciting life. Sure have. But honestly, now that I'm out here with you, I feel like I'm just getting started. Getting in trouble is what folks like us do. I mean, you and I are out here putting ourselves at risk so people in the Commonwealth can have a chance at a better life. Not for praise or reward or glory, but because it's right. I, I just wanted to let you know I'm real happy to be along for the ride. I wouldn't want it any other way. I like having you close. Oh, uh, thanks, Blue. That's, that's awfully sweet and unexpected of you. So you want to get out of here? Ours now.